Hello and welcome to another Vector Toots Plus quick tip. My name is Cheryl Graham and today we're going to talk about workspaces. Workspaces are simply the way that you arrange the panels and other interface elements in Illustrator and they can be customized to suit the type of job that you're working on. You can access the different built-in workspaces from the application bar. In the top right you'll see the word essentials. It's obviously all the tools that Adobe thinks you will need. But let's say you're a freehand user and you're coming to Illustrator, you could arrange the panels similar to the way they are in freehand. Or if you spend more time in Photoshop, for example, you could arrange the panels that way. I personally don't use the application bar, so if that's not visible, I can access the workspaces from the Windows menu. You may have noticed that there are some additional workspaces in my menu that don't come with Illustrator, and those are ones that I've made for myself. There's one that I call my basic, which is just all the panels that I usually use. There's one that I tried out putting all the panels on the right side. And if you want to make your own workspaces, just set everything up the way you want it. Then go to Window, Workspaces, Save Workspace, give it a name, and you're done. You can see your new workspace under the Workspaces menu with all the rest of them. Should you need to delete a workspace later, you can go up to Window, Workspaces, Manage Workspaces, and from there you can change the name or delete as you wish. One of the great things about workspaces is that if you're like me, you end up with panels strewn all over the work area. So I can just go back up to the Windows menu and put those panels back where they were nice and neat.